So with Shabshir and with reaching level two, um, level one hard video, I wish too hard. Um, I forgot to say how to level up fast, and I found new ways and stuff like that. Um, not new ways, but like, you know what I mean, like not in the old video. So, um, last, let's recap. Um, I said like get a lot of medals while having the flag and stuff like that. Um, you can actually see before I start this, I got 150 points for that kill, but I don't have the flag. That's because this is one of my re main reasons. Because um in um the last video, oh my god, I'm a certain oh my god, but um in the last um not video, but um last um XP like ways to level up fast. I said you get the flag, get medals. Now I recommend if you can't handle having the flag and be targeted, that's when you um. You guard the flag carrier, or you run with the flag carrier and just shoot and kill. Because you get 150 points. Now I'm getting 150 points because of the flag, but... Um... Yeah, um, so, and then... Th this isn't about XP. Um, just one tip. Oh, actually, someone it is, but... If you want to get a lot of kills, a lot of XP overall... There's a couple tips I give to you. Play CTF just because these minutes are 20, these games are 20 minutes long. Like, literally, you make a 20 minute CTF game. That's every single game. Um, you don't believe me? Each round's five minutes. You tie each round for, um, you tie the first, second, and first overtime round, and then you cap the flag at like one second left. So it's like four, it's like 19 minutes and 59 seconds. Okay. I know I'm probably gonna get like hate for like saying, oh, 20 minutes. Oh, sorry. 19 and 59. But in order to do that, you need to get a sits man. You need to get a sits man of good people like in here. Not in here, but like the gameplay itself. Um, I have a lot of good teammates. And we're all like doing very, very well. Um, if you want to like get on high streets and just like get gameplays like this, um, or get a lot of XP because I'm pretty sure I got like 40,000 XP this game. But, um, you just need to get a sits man that can get decent streets. Which, I, when I say decent streets, I mean you gotta have some people like popping out these UAVs and counters where their the enemy team can't see their mini map. Then, our team, we can see where they're at. You can see a UAV's up right there. Then, you need people that have the hater, but she's really people that can normally get a lot of streets, which. This is pretty much everyone in this sits man right here are doing haters. Well, for this gameplay I wasn't, just because I was going for mastery. But I completely um, took off the dart and rolling thunder. And now I'm running on um, counter, um, hater, and power core. And you you can see, the power core is good because they're completely clueless. Like, you have this like big EMP thing that you're always EMP'd. Like completely just like non-stop happening. It's just good, and then you get a lot of score from it too. Um, so you just need teammates that are good overall. I can get these power cores popping out, haters, UAVs, counter UAVs, um, and then also you need the people that run the high streets, like um, raps and stuff like that. That's why you see a guy sits man going, and that's really, that's really all you have to do. And then you just need to tie each round. So then it goes in the longest of time. That's why I can get so much score in this gameplay and so many kills. And not that compared to the kills, not a lot of deaths. So that's pretty much how you level up. You just gotta guess it's man. Um, try to just really just make a big place. Like just rush out there. Um, because if you rush out there, you're probably gonna get one or two kills. And if you keep doing that every every like time you spawn in, you're going to get a decent amount of XP and kills, like I did. See, 11,000 score. That's amazing. And look, 83 and 24. That's it for today, and thanks for watching.